This is a story of the man of Medan, who, played by horrors, ran and ran. He thought he could live, he thought he could be happy. <laughs> no such luck. By the end of this story, he found he didn't give up. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, do I read this? Do I read this? Yeah, have you seen this? Have you seen what's in here? Okay, it's maybe scary. Okay, okay. Continue. Sorry, guys. Confronted by unspeakable terror, the creature spoke in native tongue. I am oblivion of all you hold dear. I am the god of flesh and blood. I am the devourer of worlds, a plague, a flood. I can rip off your flesh with a single lick, tie you and restrain you, and cut off your... Right, okay guys, this is not a right, this is not right, this can't be right, this is a joke. Am I being punked here? I think I'm being punked. Okay, read the blurb. There's no blurb on here, okay? There's not even a title, I don't even know the title of this, okay? This is blurbless right now, okay? Right, oh, right, this is a joke. Okay, I'm beginning to lose it, okay? Oh, you want me to keep going, okay? Okay then, okay, it says, I will end everything you are. Your journey ends here. No more quibbles. I will rip off your big juicy... Fuck! Okay, fuck it! End it! Bullshit! Fuck! Hello everybody, Jolly John here and welcome to Man of Mida. Now I just got this game, I actually got this game on b -b 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 the weekend past. Uh, when it, the day after it came out I got the game but I've been so busy with work and stuff like that as well and I had a couple other videos to do and all that shit. So I never had the chance to do it. Now one thing you'll notice is the audio is a bit shit and I don't have a camera. Let's just dive into this while I'm talking. Yeah, so I don't have a camera guys so I have a normal baseline PS4 and I can't use the camera and the PS4 and the game, sorry, at the same fucking time. Don't play alone. Well, I'll play alone because I don't have any friends. <laughs> so, sense. So, yeah, so I'm just going to have to deal with this at the same time. I don't have enough money to be buying a PS4 Pro or anything like that, you know? So, but the good thing is you won't have to see my ugly mug. <laughs> uh, I purposely... Oh, oh, oh. Haven't checked any other videos about this. Not Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, Jacksepticeye, or Radbrad or anything. I haven't played, uh, seen anything of it. I think I've seen like two seconds of footage and that was about it. Because I want to see for myself, you know. Uh, solo story. Chinese market, Chinese South Sea. Okay. So this is from the guys that... Oh, this is from the guys that done um, Until Dawn. Which was a fucking amazing game. I played it, but not on my channel. It was before I'd done YouTube. But. Buster, we better mosey on back to the ship. <coughs> Whoa. Stop the presses. What? Looks like old Charlie Charming's got a little business to attend to. Can I fight? Hey, give me a quarter. Why? I'm gonna find out my future. Let's have it. What's in store for me, Pop? 
有疑问吗？哦、oh, ， Prince had to choose. Say nothing. Curious. Tell me about my son. Will I be rich? Dubious. So, uh, when am I gonna hit the jackpot? You know, uh, all that glitz and glamour. Oh, that's good. I can tell. Oh shit. Dragon tail, bamboo tail. Dragons are scary. Bamboo is fucking useless. So. <laughs> Bamboo. Let's go with bamboo. What does that say about me that I just picked it? Can this one be? Tell me. 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 Your财富可能来自任何方向，但是当这样的风吹来，死亡和厄运肯定会随之而来。Oh, that's not good. Doom? Wait, what? What does that mean? Hey, what does that mean? What the hell, man? Traits update. Hey, bud. Let me get a go at it. Oh yeah? Think you got the stuff? Fine. Yes. Sure. Let me another quarter. Gonna start a tab. I'll give it a whirl. Gonna be filled with death and blue uh, doom anyway, so I might as well. Oh, come on. I'm gonna take it out. Oh, Oh, man. Oh, look at this. Oh. So you said you could fight. Hey. Oh, I got skills to. Did I win? Thank you for coming to play. Kick that thing's ass. Chuck, we better get back to the ship. We don't want to get stranded. Come on, man. Just let me ask another question. We really need to get back. Traits updated. Oh, I just wanted to check this out. Or or altruistic. I don't know what the fuck that's. Guarded altruistic. Selfish. Insecure, reckless. Okay, that sounds like me. Ira. <laughs> Does so that contain in some sort of evil thing? Skull and crossbones, not a good sign. I got hiccups. Hey man, hey, where's my, where's my fifty cents? Fifty cents? What fifty cents? Come on, man. Hey, buzz off. Buddy. Nobody pushes me around. Hey.
shit. Has everything gone to shit now? To pops. Come back soon. Okay. I'll try. <laughs> I think everything's went to shit now, I would imagine. Fucking hell. What the hell? Yep, he dead. Oh, some change. Smashing. Key, that'll be for the padlock. Very nice. Okay. So guys, can you let me know in the comment section down below? Does it bother you that I've not got my camera is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> um, or does it not matter to you guys? I don't know how it is. I know the audio might be a bit more shitter than my PC because my headset's not the best one in the world, you know. <clears throat> but, uh, oh my. Get me out of here already. What the hell's going on up there? I heard aircraft and gunfire. Me too. And there was a... a corpse. What? In the sick bay. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. Fucking... Really good. Really good thinking there, sir. Hi. The controls feel weird. You know- oh fuck. In time with the heartbeat. Okay. I'm keeping calm. I'm calm. I like that mechanic. Oh fuck. Oh my. That mechanic was pretty cool. I like that. What the hell? We're gonna follow the gunfire, are we? I haven't got any pictures. Secrets! Oh. <laughs> no idea what the fuck that means. <laughs> what 
What's in here? Nothing. There's a... Excuse me. There's a door up this way. Up here. What about this? Oh, it's hey, gonna be... Charlie, help! It's gonna be some bullshit right here. Oh, no. Yeah. Why are we in there in the room that he just died in? What about his gun? God damn. Another stiff? Yeah. Oh, damn it. Buckley. Last time I saw him in the mess hall, he was fit as a fiddle. Poor fucker. Looks like he died from fear. I'm not a trained doctor or anything, but... <laughs> oh. Oh, I'm controlling him. Oh, I was sitting here watching. Getting creepy already, yeah. We're only like five minutes into the game. <laughs> Hold down one to walk faster. Okay. Oops. So, uh, is it just me? Or are you getting a real strange feeling right now? Do I look like a guy who likes to talk about his feelings? <laughs> Yes. You look like a mess. <laughs> Fuck! Jeez. Hey, Chuck? You see that kid over there? Uh... No? You feeling alright? Okay, kid, come out! You scared the shit out of me! I don't quite care for that much. Thank God I don't have a camera, actually, guys. You're gonna see a grown man cry right now. <laughs> oh, hello. Charlie! They're not dead, they only sleepeth. Oh no, they're dead. Yeah, now you're talking. God done, right, I get a gun. M1A1 Thompson, no doubt. Yeah, I don't think you really want to follow that kid, man. Oh God, no, Charlie! <laughs> hey, hold it right there, you little shit! I don't know if I was meant to shoot that or not. Whoa! Can anyone out there hear me? 
Won't you spare me over till another Hello. Hi. And welcome to my repository. Uh, you know what? Is that mean ass? No. the curator, the curator of stories, stories of love and hate, greed and beauty, life and death, oh. stories such as this one. I'm here to record the story you choose to tell. You see, this tale is only part written, and the choices you make will complete it and determine whether the lives of those with whom you are interfering continue to flourish or whether they are snuffed out. You see, we each make decisions according to our own moral compass. And we have to live with those decisions or die by them. Oops. But you shouldn't fear death. It is, after all, inevitable. It is the tax one pays for having lived and it comes, eventually, to everybody. Still, none of us want for it to come too soon, do we? No, sir, we do not. It reminds me of Untold Dawn. As in life, the actions you take matter. Mm -hmm. The choices you make will affect others. I'll be keeping a close eye on your progress. It's not my place to interfere, but I might be persuaded to offer the occasional hint. Here's one for free. There are pictures in this world that can show you some possible futures. If you can find them and study them, they may just help you to make better decisions. 
or should I say, decisions that result in the outcomes you would prefer. That's all for the moment. We'll talk again soon enough. We'll okay, have bye. The opportunity to account for all the actions that you've taken, or whatever mess you've made. Fair enough, eh? Yeah, really like Until Dawn, obviously, because the same people that made it. <laughs> Wait, Brad, Alex's brother, innocent. Okay. Duke of Milan. So this is in modern times then. Alex, Brad's brother, Julia's boyfriend, insecure and motivated. Okay. Everyone's always insecure here. Think we got enough? No. If we run out, we can always call for backup. So, uh, look. I've never been down there before. Down. The water. Diving. Or maybe you could show me how the pros do it. Are you serious? Uh, yeah. I mean, are you serious you came out here without taking any lessons? Uh, kind of, yeah. Mm hmm Oh, say nothing. Insecure. It's embarrassing. I had to work. Insecure? It's... It's what? It's embarrassing taking them by yourself. It's embarrassing you came all the way out here expecting me to hold your hand. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> so my guy's quite arrogant on this end. That dive cam is like super expensive. Look, bro, be cool. What? Julia and Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. I was invited. Uh, tag along? Seriously? I thought I was invited. Julia wanted you to come along. For real? Julia? Yeah, man. She wanted you to come. And I wanted her to see how cool you are, which you're not. So be cool. Capiche? All right, I mean, well, Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry, I'm a little snappy. I'm just. I think medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing, Julia, it's been rough. Empathetic. Yeah, I got you. It must be tough. No worries, man. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah. I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. So we should ship update. Okay. Hey. So, uh, can I get your input on something? Yeah, what? Just, uh... Kind of a big thing I'm trying to make a decision about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? I don't know what's the right thing to do. Cautious, give it some thought. Go with your gut. I'll go with your gut. There we go. Why go not? Go with your gut. If it's right, you'll know. Bearing updated. Hold on. Proposal. Brad told Alex to follow his gut. Yeah, he did. So I don't know guys if put in the comments below for the second episode anyway in the comments below this one Should I be doing decisions based on what I would do or what I think my character should do? You know because I'm not quite sure about that that one just yet. I think so there's one I missed then at the start I think I don't know <laughs> Hey. Hi Conrad's sister Alex's girlfriend Reckless and excited Conrad full hardy relaxed Julia's brother Fair enough. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Connie, this is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? Conrad. <laughs> Watch up? it, sis. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way, my little bro. Hey. Bradley! <laughs> feel like I already know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. Hey man, 
Wanna crack a cold one with me? Every second. I beg your pardon? Relax. Yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah cool. Yeah. Keep it tight. Uh, I, I love beer. I don't know what that guy's actor's name is. <laughs> the brother does. <laughs> Traits update. Right on, Radical. I like the cut of your ship. Uh, it's jib. Don't ruin it. You ever do any diving before? Never. Um, no, actually. Never done it before. Water virgin. Nice. Hey, we're gonna pop your cherry together. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, where's the old crust bucket skipper, anyhow? Fliss, impatient, captain of the Duke of Mode Courageous. Okay. So she's the boss. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but, uh... So is everybody on board and ready to go? Think so. Uh, you're selling, I'm buying. Maybe I should. Oh boy. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. This one's different. I'm just saying, if it gets too late, I know some nice places where you can just take, you know, a nice dive. Frustrated. Brad was so sure. Brad did his homework. We'll do that. Why Brad not? Brad did his homework. If he says the wreck's here, it's here. <laughs> okay, look, you're the client. I'm just saying we don't have unlimited daylight. I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? Feast your eyes on this. Ooh. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Fliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Can't dive? Who cares? Disappointed. Wait, are you saying we shouldn't dive? The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine, as long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. I just can't wait to be the first one down there. Can you imagine, untouched? We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. Right out. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. Well, I might just do that. Okay, I'm controlling them now. Hey, hey. Hey, sweetie. Can I talk Almost to you? Almost got the gear. Good to go. Concerned. Thanks for paying. Need a hand? Thanks for so, paying. <laughs> thanks again for springing for the good stuff. Nice to be able to do it right. Uh-huh. What? You know the size of my bank account is not in a competition with the size of your penis, right? 
Trivial. I'd still do good. Trivial, why not? Uh, if it was a competition, I'd still do pretty good, right? Well, if you adjust for inflation, gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. Making a fortune. I'll go with that. Seriously, where does she get off bitching about us? She's making a small fortune on this trip. Yeah, not that small. Rules are rules. I get it. But what's the big deal if nobody finds out? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. All right, I'm gonna get these rebreathers set up, and then we'll go through the final steps together. Cool. Okay. Just holler at us when you're ready. All right, I don't want to talk to him. I don't fucking like him. Hey, brother. Where you at? Trade's updated. Impatient. Ah, oh, so I think you get new traits coming through as you do more things. Okay, I, I get it. I understand. I don't really. What's up? How you doing? Hey, man. Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. You should know better. Don't worry. Hey, all part of the adventure. Sorry for putting a damper on things. No worries, dude. More than that, just to screw up the trip. Just get some rest. Come back when you're feeling better. Oh my god, I walk so slow. <laughs> what's what's that? Oh, could that be one of the pictures? What am I looking at here? Premonition unlocked. Uh, high and dry. What's this? Okay. High and dry. No idea what the fuck that means, but... We'll get there. Can I talk to you, yes? Hi. You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. Sorry about Ella. Uh, yeah, sorry about before. Everybody's just a little... We've been planning this whole thing for a while now. I get it. But there are rules, and laws, and customs. These rules are all pretty basic stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of dives? Enough to know the rules. Dived a couple. Selfish. Go with that. Dived a couple. Dived a couple wrecks over the years. Not an expert, but, you know, experienced. If this is your first unreported wreck, then you should know there's a very specific protocol you have to follow. For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. Stop shouting at me. I get it. How much? No. Who's gonna know? What's that? Come on. You see anyone else out here? Who's gonna know? We logged our route at the harbor. If someone sees it's been disturbed, it ain't gonna be hard to put two and two together. Especially if some little souvenirs show up online. <laughs> you know what? I can't stop you. Just respect the rules down there. Don't do anything stupid that'll get my ass in trouble. Okay. Not very happy. There's a little gap in the tail. Take a look. Hey guys, tanks are ready. Fucking time. Game looks amazing though, is it? Oh. Okay. Ah, yeah. So, this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Nice. Complicated. Okay. O2 check done. Whoa, 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 we 
secret beaver? You gotta check your O2 first. Appreciate it. We'll go over that. Send me straight. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Looking for a first mate. Take. What are they? You're on camera. I'll take the wheel. Yeah. Let's get a before photo. All right, kids. Good to go. Just remember the rules, please. Let's talk to her. I'm going to leave the button. Later tonight. Oh, yeah. Maybe we can fire it up again tonight for our private post uh, special. <laughs> Are you going to bring your bang stick? <laughs> nope. That front cabin is going to pop its portholes. Oh yeah, looking good. Whoa, you good? Yeah. More or less. Oh shit. Too bad Fliss is so tight. She acts like we're going to ransack the plane. Hey, a souvenir? would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> not like they can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That shape. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. Damn. It's pretty intact, too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. Captain, oh, I'm you playing as Fliss. With your second in command, you are not my second in command. Third in command. No. Fresh in your cabin, boy. Still a no. Your well-paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Pass, Pass. you ugly bastard. I have to stay focused on your friends down there. Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? Long story. It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really difficult to explain. Well, I'm a complicated guy. Try me. Well, it involves at least several trips to the bank and signing of big stacks of paper with large numbers on them. So you took out a loan. You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. Resentful. I built this business from scratch. I took out a loan on my boat and that's all the help I need. Thanks. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Duke of I, Milan. I... Oh, okay, R2. Weather looks clear. Hey. Hmm. I have to keep an eye on those clouds. Oh, it's getting mighty crowded out here. Oh shit, there's another ship coming in. Do I have to talk to him? Fucking hell. Hey there, how's it hanging? You can monitor the dive while I do some boat maintenance. Not a problem, Bob. So are you beached? What? So are you beached? Like a whale? Hey, I just thought, why spend all my time down in the dark when I already like what I see up top? I'm used. <laughs> nice one. How long you been cooking that one up? All afternoon. Good use of your time. I like to make the most of it. Mm-hmm. I'll see you later. Okay, okay. Now what? 
Hello again, little blip. What you doing all the way out here? One of us a ghost ship. Oh no. I'd have to do some maintenance on this boat, I think. Oh, there's a picture there. Why would you even have that? Why oh, do I shit. keep these around? Well. Okay, what's in here? Oh no. Ah, fuck it. Do I have to talk to this guy? How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. It's your vacation. It's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. Maybe. Hope they know what they're doing. I hope they know what they're doing down there. Attitude matters 20 meters down. Alex plays the goof, but he was pretty serious about acing his diving certification. How close? Are you close with your brother? <laughs> Known him my whole life. Julia's got Alex wrapped around her little finger. Huh. Gotta get back up top. Check you later. Bye bye. I'll have another look at this, because I'm curious to see what this is. Your default obligation. Blah, 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 blah. Right, okay, this is the... The loan for the boat, I would imagine. Fair enough, eh? I've looked at that painting there. What's that? Ah. Okay. Oh, don't want people knowing your name, do you? Oh, it's moved. I don't know if that's moving again or not. Okay, I'd like to move on from this now. Ah. Oh, shit. We have unexpected guests. I'll do a talking. Don't mention the divers. Okay. Just relax. Do not mention we have people in the water. Uh, what do you think they want? And maybe they're fishermen. I mean, maybe that's their boot. Uh, somebody, uh... Just be on guard. That'd be somebody giving know. us a warning. Like the just Until Dawn. On that's what happened then as well. Oh shit, no, there's three of them. What's that about? Fishing boat, from the looks of it. It's not the Coast Guard. That is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. Get out of here. Hey, get out of here! What do you think you're doing? We got damage here, you see this? Look at our boat! We can take care of this, man, it's not a problem. What do you think, like, uh, 10 bucks cover it? Oh, whoops, my bad, let's make it 20. 
Well, shoot, you, you think it's more like 30? I can do 30. Don't right, throw money at him. drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. Oh, shit. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? Good on ya, Connie. Julie. Oh, I'm putting his Julia hey, now. Okay. We can get in through there. I was lucky. Oh, careful. Could be dangerous. Uh, ladies first. <laughs> okay. Can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? What's that? Oh, it's a picture. this <clears throat> Julia leave it you don't have to take your gear off to get in there not worth it that pipe's pretty tight what if you get stuck without your rebreather <coughs> yeah maybe it's kind of dangerous no thank maybe you it is kind of dangerous no fucking thank you <laughs> what's this Secret found. A shell on the wrecked B-29 found lodged in the plane. The wrecked B-29 was shot down. Okay. All down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Mm-hmm. Oh. Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? Let's see what else we can find. Yeah. Maybe some zombies or monsters of some description. Good God. Ooh. Oh no. Oh, family? Hmm. Wow. Wait for something. What the hell happened here? A little look at things. They knew they were goners. He's holding something. Oh no, I've done that bit, sorry. What's this? Uh, you hear that? Let's check it out. Wanna go first? Do I ever? <laughs> oh, yeah. Ah, cheap piece of shit. Mm. Yeah, me too. Oh no, I'm not controlling this. No. And co-pilot, gotta be. 
Well done, fucking Sherlock. Not high on my list of ways to perish. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I can fly it. Uh, oh, Julia! Oh my God! Just don't touch anything else, please. Oh no. Okay, that's that guy. I just take it, we go back. Oh fuck. We gotta get out of here now. Yep, I heard that. Shark, not interested in us. Let's go. Yeah, tell that to my, tell that to my heart, my achy uh, breaky heart. Oh, okay. Thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. But I guess no time's the right time. I, I, I don't. I guess. Oh. I know you can't tell because we're underwater, but I'm on my knees right now. Uh huh. Julia. Okay. Will you marry me? No. You're shitting me, right? You're shitting me, right? <laughs> what? <laughs> like there's a hidden camera down here or something? Uh... Okay, come out guys, the gig is up! Julia, I'm serious. Oh. Um... Oh, we'll go with yes, I don't wanna... Alex, wow. What a Break his... Uh, yes, yes, I'll marry the shit out of you. <laughs> I was going to say no, but I thought it'd be a bit harsh. <laughs> Alright, handsome hero. You want to get on with our escape from the, uh, crumbling death trap? And the shark? Fliss, this is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. Hey, where'd that other boat come from? Did they capture our Wait, people? Julia, we gotta decompress here. Whoa! Damn! What the fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. Fuck it, yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Decompress, right. Oh no, high and dry. Is that... Go, go, go. Because okay, that picture was high and dry. Hey, what the hell is going on? Uh, hey, JJ, don't worry about it. Oh, barbecue. There was a little, uh, mishap with the barbecue. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. Anxious. What was up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, A plane. We found the plane, and it is huge. Full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys, can you all just shut up for like one second? Holy shit! Shark! Dude, bro, congrats! Nicely done! Come up and let's celebrate! What? Well, I'm not celebrating with you. Hmm. Hi. <laughs> You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex mm -hmm. and his little brother Brad trying to swim with the big fish mm -hmm. both seem out of their depth Did them. and Julia the love of Alex's life and he the love of hers what about Conrad a bold fellow you might say 
Or maybe you'd say arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss, strong, forthright, stubborn. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. Let me reassure you, you help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. Special feature unlocked. And some I think they may regret. Like marriage. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Right, okay guys, I'll pause it here, and on episode 2, I'll immediately come straight back to this, and uh, we'll continue on. Leave a like, subscribe to the Jolly John Show to help me out, and I'll see you guys in this next episode, hopefully soon. <laughs>